We're, we're, our plan is to blow this wall and pack it full of cellulose. So when, when I drill the holes, I've got a drill over here and a four inch hole saw that we can use and we can see where each of the stud cavities is by where the nail holes and screw holes are. And uh, when I drill those cavities, if I'm doing the install, I like to make it at about my chest height so that when there's any blowback, it doesn't come right in my face. So I'm going to drill this hole right here. Now, just as a tip, you can get something like a, in a, like a clothes hanger or, or something like a piece of wire. I could go get a clothes hanger, a tape measure, and what I'm doing now, it's going, it's showing me I got six inches back to the, where my stud is, see what I mean? I go the other direction, and it's showing me that I got about five and a half, and there may be a situation where there's some kind of junk in there, you know, I could, I could measure to, to, to the top, to the bottom, to find out if there's any kind of fire stop, you see what I mean? So I can actually get in there and see where things are going. And if I know I'm going to drill my next hole, I can say, okay, there, right there at six inches is the next one, so I need to go over a little bit. So that's just kind of a tip. You can find where your studs are. The, the real, the OSHA 10 people would say to do this with a non-metallic probe. So in case there's bare wiring in there that you're not shocking yourself to death. So we want to, we want to save all these because when we're finished and we've packed it with cellulose, we want to put these back in hold them in place with foam, and then we can tape and mud over them, and nobody will know we've ever been here, you know? And I'd like to come at this. So all of these we take out, we can like throw them over here in the corner, and uh, we'll go back and get them and put them back in. Yeah, you're going to have right in there, get the little drill point, push on it, give it a little bit of a lean. Now, now there you go. There you go. Oh, go ahead. It's you're doing. It's that way, so if I all right. let go, you're I don't doing. Have to cut out. All right, easy then. Hold tight. All right, that's enough. Good job. Good job. See, you, and it's mostly getting the feel of it. Yeah. Once you get the feel of it, then you you know how tight you have to hold it. So you can do another one now, probably just like a pro, right? You know. And generally speaking, I don't recommend cellulose below grade in situations where you just don't know whether or not people will ever screw it up because in fact it will absorb its weight in water so do you want to do anything until that problem is yeah, fix, the, fix the water first the, yes it would be the best choice would be to fix the water first when we say 